Yeah, fast and 14 here and today. I'll be showing you how to make a basic inventory system. Now, I've already created it off screen and done the bugging and the uh, bug checking and stuff like that. So, um, I include string because we'll be working on um, string like one on one character. Now, I know there's only one data type in the struct. But, like, say if you want to, like, item effect or item effect index or, like, um, who can wield this weapon or weapon or item type or something like that. So, I just like having a struct temporarily so I can change it later on once. But this is basic, so. Um, so I'm going to find item items. I'm not sure if, if you just put I am now it will work too, but I never really tried that. And then put down 10 elements. And then we iterate through it so I won't uh, keep on writing line after line the same old thing. Just with, different, with, the, just with a different index. Then we get in choice, I'll explain why that later. Index, I'll explain that later. And string name, I'll explain later as well. Those are just it's a it's a reminds us for later. Then we have while true, obviously it's a loop around and stop. Then we have your inventory, and then it'll iterate through all the items, putting a space with I mean a line break and then the name of the item and another line break is make it clean. And then D and slash N. It just means another thing for light, like a line break, and then put on at the end too for cleaner. So we got add item, drop item. And then we use our choice to get input from the user. So CN like console in, and then uh, we got switch. This one. Uh, Check any case that they're true, and they're not. It would, well, I didn't really make sense for that. You you feel like default in like so in case you play default, but I didn't really just do that. Well, default though, that just if it's not true, then do that. But I am bother. So if we if we um press one, they'll say enter I am name. We um. I mean, we input the name, and then uh, it'll iterate through the not entire array, but until it finds something that's a space. The name equals like a space where it's empty, and then at that index, it'll set the name to what you specified. It'll break out of the loops, and it won't be checked out anymore. And then we break again, break out of this case. And then we use um, case 2, which is drop item. Then what items do you want to drop? It'll iterate through a name list of what items you have in the CN index. This one, this means, um, don't like type in the item name, you type in your index number. And I get I get the index number right there, so it'll if items index it was nothing. It's the empty slot. Otherwise, it'll just make make an empty space, make it um nothing. So and then break out loop. I mean break out of the case like always. So let's run this and make sure you're watching the full screen because I'll be. Recording all my videos full screen from now on. And yeah, I haven't compiled it. So. What? I'll compile it again. I don't remember what name I called it. The heck?
Oh, it's not capital. Sorry. All this fumbling here. There we go. Alright, now, um, let's minimize this. Let's uh, run the program. And, um, like before, we have this big old gap right here from one of the line breaks. And we got options right here. So, we had no, we had nothing down there, so let's try and drop something while we're at it. And, yeah, we get nothing, and spread nothing in inventory, so, just click like 6, and I don't know what to put in there. And you can really like see it, it just says empty the lot. So then, um, let's add some items. Uh, I really don't care, like, it doesn't really matter. And let's add another item. And my item. I'm gonna do all of this with the whole entire inventory filled. Sorry that I'm playing Jimmy Jabber, but it really doesn't matter to me. Now, our inventory is full, so what will happen if we add another item? It does absolutely nothing. So let's clear it up. We have all this junk in our inventory that has done nothing either way, so let's clear this out. I'll find them and see how it's cleared. And we can just keep on dropping everything, so. so. Oops. No! Dang it. Sorry, there's no way we can go back. Alright, shot zero again. I think it's the point. <laughs> yeah, so if you have any questions, leave a comment below and I'll see if I can answer it. Thanks for watching.